Welcome to Crane Love Time to the Glorious God. What are we doing today? We're making a grocery challenge. <laughs> We're doing a grocery haul video because we went shopping today and I was talking to my sister-in-law who watches the channel and she wanted to see what we got. So I said that I'd do a video. So I don't even remember exactly how much I spent on all this stuff because we went to multiple places and all of that stuff. But anyway. And we got this. We got corn at the farmer's market. So I'll start with the farmer's market. Hold on. That's not farmer's market. Okay. Start at the farmer's market. We got a dozen ears of corn. Those were $8. I know that. We got some tomatoes, which they've already started eating. We got Napa cabbages. Uh, if you've never had Napa cabbage, it's a good mix between cabbage and lettuce. It's, um, and we got on, pea it's a, shoot. <laughs> it's a good mix between cabbage and lettuce. It's not as tangy as cabbage, but it has um, more consistency, like a um, thicker, thickerness. Thickerness. <laughs> I'm gonna make up words than regular lettuce. So it's a good thing to try. It's very mild. You, we cut it up and put it on like tacos and stuff. We bought a bunch of onions. We bought carrots in here. Naomi, can you show the hand? Naomi's videotaping. In here are peppers and a thing of tomatoes. We got pea shoots and we got eight dozen eggs. So that was the farmer's market. And Naomi's gonna eat one of those tomatoes. Okay, so then we went Stop touching, please. Then we went to the Shaw's, which is our local Albertsons affiliate. And we don't usually go into Shaw's because my mom buys the Shaw's things on her way home from work. Stop poking the meat. <laughs> she usually buys it on her way home from work, but we went in today and I actually found some good deals. So we went in because the meat was $2.77. Sorry, the hamburger was $2.77 a pound, which is really good price here in Maine. I don't know what your meat's going for, but that's a really good sale price. It's 80-20 meat. Um, but while we were in there, I also found, we picked these up because I thought we were gonna use them for lunch, but then we ended up not using them. But those were from there. Um, these cheeses were $1.99 for the seven and a half ounce packages, like seven to eight ounce packages. Um, and we were gonna use some cheese for lunch. So we did open one of these and we found this cheese on Markdown. We found bacon on Markdown, so it was 30% off, but these were already on sale, so then they were 30% off. And these, which are like lunch meat combo of turkey and ham, we don't buy lunch meat very often, but these can go right in the freezer and you can pull them out to be able to make sandwiches day of. So I bought a couple because they were marked down also 30% and they were on sale. We also found these sausages. This is a 19 ounce package and they came up to 350 a package. So that's a pretty good price. Adds a lot of flavor. You need less meat if you're using it as flavoring for something. Okay, I'm walking around the table. Ugh. Okay, we bought apples for 99 cents um, a pound. We bought two bags and these were the favorites for lunch. <laughs> oh. Do you know what that is? Guacamole. Guacamole. And what's this? Hummus. Hi. Both of these were on sale today, so we picked those up also. Hey. Yeah. Oh, I'm stepping on shoes. We just got home, so there's shoes on the ground. Oh, we have a swing in our doorway. This is a favorite of the children. Mm -hmm. Okay. Then we went to Dollar Tree, and I bought four of these containers and three of these containers. I'm looking to organize our school supplies. Someone asked me to make a school supply um, like haul, but we never actually went to Walmart this year and bought any school supplies because I already have lots in my cupboard. And so I have organized it, but I used the containers that I had to put like all the colored pencils and all the crayons and all the stuff that we already had. And those containers don't fit well together. So I got things that would be, make everything in there more uniform. So I got those and then I got coloring books. These are for our trip in a few weeks. We're gonna be going to Tennessee to see Virginia Wayland and Baby Justice. We're so excited. And I got some coloring books for the kids to have for the car, um, just something different. And then our last, our last thing was we went and picked up a splint that is for Naomi. I don't know if splint, a brace, a brace for Naomi's knee. 
If you haven't heard, Naomi a few weeks ago hurt her knee. Oh, well, actually a couple months ago now. Dislocated her knee. We've recently gone to the doctor because that's when they could get us in and they're putting him in this. So anyway, I need to get someone down for a nap. This little guy and that little guy over there. Did you show his cute outfit? Can we see your outfit? <laughs> but little monkey man needs a nap. So we're going to go lay people down and put all this food away. And we will see you guys next time on Herding Little Cows to the Glory of God. Say bye-bye. Say bye-bye.